It's about time for the third and final group game for Nigeria and Canada at the ongoing 2022 FIFA Women's World Cup, which is happening live in Costa Rica. At the stance right now, Nigeria currently lead the group with 6 points after defeating France and South Korea by a single goal while Canada on the other hand are currently bottom of the group with no point after losing 2 goals to nil to South Korea in their first game they are losing 3 goals to 1 against France in their second group game In this video, I will be doing a quick match review give you my predictions and tell you how to watch the match live The match we played in the early hours of Thursday morning the 16th of August by midnight 3am Nigerian time at the Estadio Alejandro Moreno Soto in Costa Rica as our head to head record in the competition Nigeria have met Canada 3 times at the 20 Women's World Cup losing once in 2002 and winning twice in 2006 and 2016 a draw for Nigeria in this game will guarantee us winning the group while a win will ensure we have a 100% win record in the group and if we win this group, we will be playing against the second in Group D which could either be Netherlands, United States or Japan Even though it seems like Canada can't make it out of the group it doesn't mean they will just sit back and relax for Nigeria to walk all over them I'm sure they will put up a strong fight and possibly want to get a point or even all three points against Nigeria. Looking at the Canadian team, I noticed that the majority of the team is made up of college players with players coming from schools like Harvard, University of Southern California, among many others. Seeing is super talented with players like Simisola, Feishayo, Awujo. Yes, I'm talking about the Canadian team right now. Zoe Bonds, who actually made a debut for Canada playing against Nigeria in the National Friendly in April of this year. Jade Rose, Olivia Smith, in fact, she's a very talented young player to watch out for, among many others. For Nigeria, on the other hand, I'm interested to see the team the coach put forward for the game against Canada. Looking at the fact that we have already qualified to the quarterfinals, maybe some players will be rested while others get the chance to play. Regardless of the decision of the coach, I know Chris Dandruma knows his team really well and definitely he will know how to rotate them adequately. And I just hope that some of these players are able to transition to the Super Falcons after this competition and maybe some even get scouted to top teams around the world I should carry my prediction I see this match ending 2 goals to nil in favour of Nigeria I like the fact that we have been keeping clean sheets throughout the competition and I hope it continues to continue to keep clean sheets like that like that continuously basically and uh, if you want to watch the match live you can watch on FIFA Plus just go on Google search FIFA Plus you should be able to stream all the matches live on the official website of FIFA and guys please I just want to inform you that I just created a new channel yesterday Ademola Victor TV Extra please subscribe to the channel as well and if you're not subscribed to this channel what are you waiting for please guys I'm begging you subscribe to the channel I promise to continue posting regular sports updates regarding Nigeria and other African teams as well so expect those videos as well thanks for watching and as always have a good day see you all later bye and god bless